Hello everyone, this is Barka Technical Solution and I am Pedro Stroman. In this video, we are going to see how to create an home alert system using the ultrasonic sensor and a buzzer. So, this is our circuit. Now, let us see how we can actually build this. So, the first thing we are going to do is we are going to connect the VCC pin of our ultrasonic sensor to the 5 volt pin and the ground to the ground pin. Then we are going to connect the trick pin of our ultrasonic sensor to pin number 11 and the echo pin to pin number 10 and then we have to connect our buzzer. So, here in this case we are going to connect the ground pin of our buzzer to ground and the positive pin to the pin number 3 and that is all we have to do. So, now let us go to our Arduino ID and see how we can actually program this Arduino. So, now we are in our Arduino ID. So, here the first thing we have done is we have included the library of our ultrasonic sensor new pin dot h and we have defined the trick pin and echo pin the trick pin and echo pin of our ultrasonic sensor and we have defined the max distance for that ultrasonic sensor and then we have defined the and we have created a object called sonar so that we can actually control our ultrasonic sensor and we have included the trick pin echo pin and the max distance in that object. Then we have defined the buzzer pin which is the pin number 3 and in the void setup what we have done is we have firstly we have connected the serial monitor and then we have set the pin modes of our trick pin then our echo pin and then the buzzer. So, except the echo pin the others will all be set to output and the echo pin will be set to input mode and in our main part the void loop part. So, the first thing we are going to do is we are going to set our trick pin to low for 2 microsecond and then we are going to set our trick pin to high now for 10 microsecond and then we will set our trick pin to again low. So, the first two line is actually to control so that we know that the trick pin has actually been open or has actually been on for 10 microsecond not more than that. Then we are going to set our echo pin to high and now the echo pin will be on and it will receive the uh, sound wave that has been transmitted from the trick pin and then it will and then it will be received and then will be sent to this pulse in special function so that it can actually calculate the length of that sound wave and so then the length of the sound wave will be saved in this duration variable which is an integer variable as we do not want to difficult what we are doing. So, we will just stick with integer variable. Then we are going to come to the next line here we will be dividing the duration by 2 because the sound wave is actually travelling twice the same length. So, we are going to divide it by 2 then we have get, got the actual distance and then we will be dividing that by 29.8. So, this is the time that takes sound wave to travel 1 centimeter in the air. So, that is how we are going to get it get the distance in centimeter and that will be saved in this distance variable which is also an integer variable. Then we are going to set a condition to turn on our buzzer or so here what I have set is the di if the distance is greater than 10 then the buzzer will be on low. So, the buzzer will be off. If something is less than 10 meter something is in less than 10 meter radius then the buzzer will be turned on and it will start making noises to alert us. So, that is how it, this uh, code will work. So, now let us go and see it working. So, this is the circuit that we are going to create. So, as you can see we have our ultrasonic sensor our buzzer and it is all connected to this Arduino Uno. So, here as you can see the so the VCC pin here is the red one, the trick pin is the green one, echo is the blue one and the ground is the black one. So, the blue and green, so this is the trick pin which is connected to pin number 11 and the blue one is the echo pin which is connected to pin number 10. This red pin is the positive pin of the our, uh, of our buzzer which is connected to pin number 3 and the 
other red pin which is connected to the VCC of our ultrasonic sensor is connected to 5 volt pin of our Arduino and the rest two the white and the black one are the ground pin of our buzzer and our ultrasonic sensor which is connected to this ground pin of our Arduino. So, that is all we have it is all in our circuit. So, now let us connect this to our computer and see how this works. So, now if I put my hands in front of our ultrasonic sensor as you can hear the, the buzzer is on. If I move my hand the buzzer is off. So, so the distance is here is also 10 centimeter. So, if there is something in between 10 centimeter the ultrasonic sensor will trigger the buzzer and it will produce the noise and if something is out of 10 centimeter then the buzzer will not trigger. So, that is how this works. So, thanks everyone for watching the video. If you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like this.